Hey guys, welcome back. You're still tuned into Power Breakfast, and let's now talk about the big earnings that came through post market close yesterday. First up, we have LNT, which posted uh, numbers. So Rima is here to bring us all of the highlights from the fourth quarter performance. Hi, Rima. Hi. Uh, so in one line, weak margins but very strong order inflows. Uh, so for Q4, there was a slight miss compared to street expectations. Revenue growth came in at 10.4 percent. Margins declined by 60 basis points to 11.7 percent. The street was anticipating flat margins, so there was a margin miss, and that led to a miss on the company's profitability as well. So Q4 slightly lower than expectations, but the miss was on margins, and that's the reason why the company also missed its FY23 margin margin guidance. Uh, so that was a miss. That said, the order inflows and the order book is quite strong. The order inflows in Q4 were more than 76,000 crore rupees and their order book is touching 4 lakh crore mark. Uh, so on the order side, things are strong. FY24 guidance is also seen fairly healthy. Revenue growth seen at 12 to 15 percent. Order inflow guidance of 10 to 12 percent. The company is also guiding for a core EBITDA margin improvement of about 40 to 50 basis points. And they also have indicated that they have a solid new pipeline. Uh, there is a leadership change which has been announced. So AM Nike is going to be stepping down as a non-executive chairman of the company, effective 30th of September. And he will now be the chairman emeritus, while SN Subramaniam, who is currently the CEO and MD of the company, he's been redesignated as the chairman and managing director. So a bit of a leadership overhaul, but as I said, in a nutshell, uh, weak margins by l and in Q4, dragging down the profitability compared to estimates, but the order inflow is strong and the company's guidance for FY24 is healthy. The stock, remember, has outperformed the Nifty by nearly 30% in the last one year. Back to you. All right, Rima, thanks a lot for bringing us that fine print. In fact, on exactly this, on the order inflows as well as the margin, let's also listen in to some management comments. This is from the conference call. So listen in to what whole time director and CFO R. Shankar Raman had to say. We had to account for all the additional costs during FI23. And consequently, the margins uh, have turned out to be 8.6% as compared to the 9.3% of the previous year. And looking at um, uh, the way the projects are lined up, it appears that uh, we could um, see a 10 to 12% improvement in order intake, a fresh order intake in FI24. Uh, uh, looking at the order book of nearly 4 lakh crore, I think we can work towards uh, revenue growth of 12 to 15 percent in FI24. And uh, as I mentioned just a little while ago, we will work to improve the margin profile from the 8.6 percent levels of FI23 to somewhere around 9 percent uh, for FI24. All right, so that is just a snippet. In fact, we will be joined by R. Shankar Raman, who is the whole time director and chief financial officer of LNT at 11.30 a.m. today on Trading R. So remember to catch that conversation and all of the action. The other